How you guys doing? You know, this is very important in reference to oh, one of the people I was talking to on Instagram. I guess it was Blue. It was his, well, the guy on a, he had like a Brett Farr picture on his Instagram. But uh, back in the other points of information, uh, in reference to like uh, people playing, uh, you know, this game of people slandering my character or people, you know, stalking me or people trying to play their psychological uh, flippity flop, you know, good cop, bad cop tricks, you know. You ever seen those movies? You know, when they try to good cop, bad cop people. You know, in reference to the guidelines of my parents, you know, and the family history, and my DNA's on record, too, at the police station. Perfectly healthy, too. And, you know, anybody, as everybody knows, anybody har trying to, to slander my character is, you know, potential suspects, or they might be related to people that murdered my parents. I have said go public with the information of who my biological parents are. The Treasury even has documents that they're supposed to do that. So what's the problem? DNA's on record, family history's on record. Why isn't the FCC forcing to go public, the information? Obviously, people need to get fired from a lot of places. And all this endangerment is serious. You know, they tried to do this shit, they did this shit to me in California. Tried to mess with my uh, little apartment. They were stealing my money out of my checking account in California. They were stealing money from my lawsuit monies from the car accident on Sunset Boulevard. They tried to, you know, they kept calling out to California from Indiana. And Pac Bell has a lot of records of that, don't they? Plus the studios do too, because, you know, I was dating some celebrity female or hanging out with some people and friends sometimes, you know. And, uh, you know, I had cable. So, you know, cable boxes, at least the cable box I had, had a listening device in it. And the TV had a listening device in it. And I even had an alarm in my apartment, too. Now, they had a, they had arrested uh, Frank outside my apartment at 7513 Fountain and Gardener before, too, didn't they? And they arrested Frank outside uh, some female's location that I was hanging out with. He was stalking me in California, too. And Frank was one of the people that kidnapped me from my mother and father's mansions in California. And he's one of the people that kidnapped me from the studios. And he's one of the people that kidnapped me from North Carolina, wasn't he? And he's one of the people that kidnapped me from, North, uh, from New York and New Jersey, too, wasn't he? I'm not playing tricks with people, man. There's been restraining orders on Frank. There's been restraining orders on these politicians. Now, see, the thing of it is, is they need to check these people to see if they stole any of my sperm or if they have illegal children, which is human trafficking crimes, and they must get arrested. So, you know, in reference to the situation of uh, dirty government, picking on me. There's been restraining orders the whole time. The courts are not following the procedure documents of 